come on in, hit the like button, think about subscribing if you're already. And if you are new here, welcome to the channel, but most importantly, welcome to the Viking family. So this is going to be my personal opinion for 65. Now I just came back about an hour or so uh, from going to see the theaters on day one. And this stars Adam Driver. Now here's the plot. After a catastrophic crash on an unknown planet, pilot Mills quickly discovered he's actually stranded on Earth 65 million years ago. Hence the name. Now, with only one chance of, at a rescue, Mills and the only survivor, Koi, a little girl, must make their way across an unknown terrain riddled with dangerous prehistoric creatures, aka dinosaurs. Uh, and here is the cast. So totally not what I was expecting. It was not what the trailers gave the impression for, even though I only watched one and only like half of it because they give too much away. Hollywood tends to always have great set and prop designs when it comes to future slash space films. But in my opinion, the lack of story detail and lack of story as a whole was frustrating to me throughout the film. Many parts I really needed a lot more details to to understand his story and specifically his job and what the backstory behind the girl is. And if you see the film, you'll understand because you'll be asking the same thing specifically about her story. Uh, another thing is there was barely any talking from the two characters, which was an also annoying because it didn't feel like there was that much chemistry between them because of lack of it. Um, I understand the some of the uh, the writers, obviously not the main writer who was the director, at least in the first one. Um, I've heard his name, but you know, it, it, they they of the uh, of the of the films, um, whatever it's called, I'll have it right here. Um, but and it's advertised like that. However, I think with those films, it had a lot more going for it to push it forward and fill in a little bit of details. I think it was mostly the suspense. Okay, um, with this, there was a lack of, not a lack of suspense, I would say. There was definitely some suspense parts in here uh, and definitely some scary parts. But I think between the lack of talking and the lack of uh, detail in the story to lead into the story, it just, I couldn't get into it. Um, there was a couple of cute funny scenes though and plenty of jump scares that got me every time. But overall, I wasn't impressed one bit, unfortunately. Now maybe I should have gone with a little bit more, less high expectations. Now I didn't go into it with high, high expectations or even just high, but they were still pretty up there. Uh, so to speak, and you know, maybe I should have gone up with a little again with a little bit low excitation, but I don't think that would have changed my personal opinion. But here's my rating. Yeah, not much else to say other than I suggest waiting for streaming to watch this. Be honest with you. I really wasn't worth the money and the drive time. Uh, I mean, that's really all I got to say. It, it's it's just it's a frustrating type of thing. Uh, it was more of, hey, I got to get out of the house. Uh, you know, I'm here all the time, and I need something to review. So I was excited to watch this, but again, I think I might have had a little bit too much expectations from this, considering it looks cool. It, it also um was the the writers from the the show that I, I I'll, again I'll put it right here I keep forgetting the name um but uh, the two movies which I absolutely loved but uh yeah it, it was just a big disappointment in my opinion um but let me know in the comments below what you guys think um I am going to be having maybe not tomorrow but probably Sunday 
Um, but I'll, I'll, you'll find out if it, it's still hitting the bell icon when you, you find out. But I'm going to be doing finishing the yellow jackets. I've been slowly getting the past, through them past several days. So I've um, been struggling, not because of the, the show, but because of my tiredness and stuff. So it's just, it is it's a whole thing. Um, but remember, I love you all. Please stay safe and school.